Okay, so I done a cheap ass martial art video. I'll make it up to you guys later. Alright, look, y'all. I know the masks are inconvenient. I've gotten both of my COVID shots. And it still doesn't mean that I'm safe from the variations that's happening. According to the news, the variations are a little bit more powerful than the shit that I initially got shot for because of Class A mutations. For those who do not know what a Class A mutation is, the reason why I'm classifying it as a Class A mutation is because I am a Marvel fan. A Class A mutation is pretty much a low-level mutation that becomes a small, tiny spark that becomes a gigantic-ass explosion until you get to Omega level. Alright? Now, these new mutations of this coronavirus has been fucking people up. I'm sorry for cussing. This is not the channel for you if you are super Christian. Alright? And I'm pretty sure Christians curse too. I've actually heard of preachers who used to F bum before. Anyway, no, it wasn't the preacher that hit me with this car. But, if you wanted to give me the chase of the Holy Spirit, all you needed to do was get the Bible out. You didn't have to run over top of me. Anyway, moving on. These masks that we wear, yeah, they're inconvenient. Yeah, they're a pain in the ass. Yeah, you can find any excuse you want to not wear the damn thing. I don't know about y'all, I miss hugging my grandmother last year. I miss seeing my grandmother who's like pushing 90 something years old. And for you selfish people who don't give a damn about me or my grandmother, look, I don't give a damn if you have a breathing problem, alright? Do not use that shit as an excuse if you don't suffer from asthma, emphysema, or if you don't have some underlying serious breathing condition that if you breathe natural air, your ass is going to kill over and die. If you're not living in a fucking bubble, like the kid in the bubble from years ago when I was younger who had to live in a bubble because he couldn't be exposed to air, if you're not living in that shit, your issue ain't that damn serious. So get over yourself, take your head out of your ass, and put on the mask. It's not that difficult, and I'm sorry if I'm offending anybody. I don't have a problem with wearing the mask because I'm looking out for everybody. Yeah, everybody's worried about this shit, and you should be. Because this is how like things like the bubonic plague and shit happens, because there's always some asshole who knows a little bit more than the doctors, who thinks, hey, doctor's not right. No, what happens is that you may be immune to certain shit, because some of us humans actually are immune to damn near everything. That's what makes us special for everything that is human. Every human has something that some of us don't have, and some of us have things that others do. Alright, for instance, I have a brother who has shingles. I didn't get shingles. I had the chicken pox one time. And the shit that they gave us in the 70s and 80s was apparently stronger than the shit they gave you kids in the 90s. So, therefore... And it's probably something that just happens to be genetic. Maybe he was meant to get the fucking shingles. And maybe I just wasn't. You know, I had a hip replacement. Maybe the metal in my leg protects me from getting other shit. I don't know. I am not a scientist. I'll play one on TV if you guys get me the job at Disney. But anyway, you like I threw that in there? Please, for the love of God, and for the sake of all the elderly people, wear your damn mask. If you have an issue wearing a mask... I don't have a cell phone because I'm using it. Call delivery. They have hands-free delivery. Pizza has it. Like, Domino's has it for sure. I'm not sure if Pizza Hut even delivers pizza anymore. I know Little Caesars may have started or may have stopped delivering pizza. Um, restaurants are certain restaurants like McDonald's and them. I think they may have the no-contact fucking thing. You give them the money and someone barely hands you the food. I don't really know because I don't fucking eat out. I, I eat my food at home. I cook it myself. But, you know, if the mask is this much of an issue for all you young people, for all you people who do the one damn thing that I will never do, which is shop online, shop online. They will deliver that shit. Your job is to be at home when the delivery gets there so the push pirates won't steal your shit. Understand. So for the love of God, and for the sake of all that is holy, wear your damn mask. Simple as that. Thank you for watching. This is Comfort Havoc number two. All right.